you tech? Are you ready to do this? Let's be sweet tech is different from every convention conference that's out there. There's nothing that's the same except a bunch of really smart fucking people being in the same place. It's just incredible to see an event that's only been uh, here for two years grow to this, this type of size. It's, it's really impressive. Imagine one of the best tech conferences you've ever been to with only lesbians, basically, and allies. Whatever level you are at, technically or professionally, there will be somebody to meet you and help carry you forward. My least favorite expression is unconscious bias, which I think there's oh, nothing... Tell us why. Because there's nothing unconscious about it. You know what you're... Woo! Preach. It's really nice to be somewhere where that's not a sausage fest and to really get uh, really smart women involved in technology. It's almost like a TED Talk, except with cooler people. <laughs> We've decided to name our coding scholarship after you, the Lesbians Who Tech Edie Windsor Coding Scholarship Fund. Please welcome to the stage Edie Windsor. You just had this award named after you. How do you feel? Well, as soon as I stop crying, okay, I'll be feel fine. <laughs> the essential aspects of emotion and creativity and transparency and authenticity. These are things that a lot of corporations are just beginning to discover. And Lesbian Who Tech is so, so far ahead of the game. It's a place that you can find new friendships. It's a place that you can find new jobs. It's the place that, that you can find new mentors and, and hear new and exciting ideas. This community is here so that we can be more than we think we can be. And when we are together, that truly is possible. Lesbians Who Tech makes that possible. So what are you going to do to create the world you want to see? What kind of leader are you going to be? Thank you. Thank you. Lesbians Who Tech, welcome to the stage, your VP of Growth, Dom Brassi. Wow. Wow. I've been following you all on Twitter. <laughs> and you're amazing. Lesbian to tech. If you don't know where you are, you found the right place anyway. I don't know how you got in here because, <laughs> because this is a special room. Lesbian to tech is a global network of over 25,000 queer women and gender nonconforming people in tech. And that means we're creative, industrious, we're full of ingenuity, we collaborate, we're curious, we're relentless, we're disciplined, we're amazing. Everyone in this room and everyone you're sitting next to is an incredible person. And so here's the thing about Lesbian Sue Tech. <clears throat> we're here to support the visibility, the leadership, and the influence of queer women and gender nonconforming people. Because one of the things about this community is we do it for ourselves. The people who show up are the people who make this event and this community and this tech sector what it is and everything that it can be. So you're in the right place, and here's the thing. Everybody here tonight is an early adopter. So I know you're tweeting this. We're gonna go through these hashtags really fast so you understand what this is about. And after this, we're gonna pop on out of here and do our main task of the night, which is shaking hands, learning faces, totally creeping on people on Twitter, figuring out who people are, following people on the app, and y'all who are doing the leaderboard already, y'all are competitive. <laughs> like, gamification is real. I just left all the default settings, and I'm like, holy shit, people are winning this. You can win? <laughs> yeah, and your dogs are cute. All right, so here's what's up with the hashtags. Everybody who has the app, this is an important thing. Who's downloaded the app? I know there's 500 of you. Oh, yes! Yes, oh, fantastic. If you don't have the app yet, totally 
Figure it out with the person next to you. Be like, hey, where'd you get that? And person who got it, like sit and do like awesome customer support and super <laughs> community support. Because that's the thing is like, one of the things that's special about the people who show up in this room, in this community, is that we show up for each other and help each other out. So do it for real, sit down and wait until the app is downloaded, wait until the login is completed. And if you need help, there is somebody on Twitter, tweet at lesbian tech. We're, we're drinking all the, all the Kool-Aid and all the sauce. All right, so the first one is the most important one. Everything you tweet, Facebook, Instagram, everything, platforms I haven't heard of yet that you're totally gonna sell me on this weekend, use LWT Summit. People in Australia are doing this. People in South America are doing this. Our whole community, which is global, is not here in this room. Like We are the people who are lucky enough to be in this space that is an alternate universe. We've inverted everything about the way we experience power in the world because of our gender, maybe we're marginalized in our, our gender, gender expression or our orientation. All of that in this room for these next couple of days is inverted. The power is ours, the leadership is ours, the voice is ours, and the community is ours. So that's what that first hashtag is about. LW Summit, use it. And everybody who is not here is also using it and following it, and we're getting a ton of traffic. And so if you're competitive, enjoy that. LWT Selfie, that pretty much explains itself. Y'all are cute. Don't even hide it. Go to LGBT Slack, tweet us. LWT Slow-Mo, this one, oh, every year, one or two people do it, but it's amazing. So you people who actually like live the slow-mo dream, thank you. <laughs> like it's not popular, but it is incredible. So thank you. I had LWT fashion, oh, y'all are cute, that's it. <laughs> LWT friends, when, when we come here in San Francisco, this is my third summit, I see people and I feel like it's a family reunion. Like my first year I was nervous, I was intimidated, it was really scary. Um, I didn't really know how to introduce myself, like I couldn't do an elevator pitch. And now, like I see people and I'm like, oh my God, wow, God, congratulations on that change. Like I've been following you on Twitter, like that's how I figure out how to make friends. So use that hashtag. And lastly, I think you know this, anybody in the Women Who Code network and community, applaud her is the hashtag that they use to congratulate people and celebrate people and really put our leadership and our visibility forward and give people props. So applaud hair. <laughs> because it's amazing and that takes work. So applaud hair. All right, so this is what's gonna happen tonight. I'm gonna bring up the Vice President of External Affairs at the Ms. Foundation who is on the advisory board of Lesbian Two Tech. Please welcome Angelique Roche. <laughs> I'm applauding her hair right now. Hi. Okay, we're gonna try that again. We're about to go drinking, so we have to have a little bit more enthusiasm. Hi! So much better. So dumb. So what's up? So there's some things. Yeah, there's, I see these areas. There's like an area here. There is an area, and we have three of them. Look. There are three areas. Oh my God, what are you gonna do with three areas though? I think we should break them up into three different groups. And I think that top group up there should probably be in this group. So there's like a center area and then the top together. This is why you do what you do. <laughs> so we're gonna have three groups. What I, I think, do we have names for these groups? There's a, the first of them is, a, wait, there's a song. What's that song? Remember when we were, <laughs> oh, is that Prince? That is Prince. All right, so I so the first group is going to be named Prince. Why do we have groups though? Are we doing something with these groups? So, yes. So, because we're going to go drinking and there's so many amazing people in here, we want to make sure that we do this in an orderly fashion. <laughs> So we're going to break these four. <laughs> can't even Wait, keep a straight just, face. Let's just introduce a tech crawl. Let's just introduce a tech All right, crawl. we're going to do a tech crawl tonight. <laughs> Who saw that on the program? <laughs> and here's how it works. 
We've got three areas and three teams and three venues. The first area is this center area. That's Team Prince. Prince is gonna go to the first venue, yeah! Which is the cafe. Who knows where the cafe is? My cafe people, yes, all right. You got somebody to follow. The cafe, we're gonna go out, we're gonna go up right, and it's right, it's a half a block away and you're gonna follow me. Isn't there some volunteers? There are some volunteers. So we're gonna bring up our volunteers and we're gonna have signs because we're gonna make this easy for you. So Team Prince, is gonna follow the Prince sign, which will shortly come up here. Two signs on that the stage. Two signs, signs on the stage. Yeah. All right, and the way that this is gonna work <laughs> are Team Prince, we're gonna go to the cafe. We're gonna hang out for 30 minutes. I just wanna acknowledge that some of us will be drinking non-alcoholic beverages because we're about inclusion, affirmation, safety, and coolness. <laughs> but Team Prince, don't move just yet because we have other teams. What, there's other teams? There are other teams. What? So, we also have this team over to our, our left, your right, team. Do we have the song? Are we gonna play the song? Can, <laughs> can we have? Uh. Oh, oh, oh. I'm actually really excited because Team Gaga is going to come with me this evening and follow this amazing sign right Yay. here. And we are going to be heading over to the pavilion first. Now, what Dom didn't say is that we're going to be doing a little bit of a merry-go-round tonight. So we're all going to switch. So don't feel jealous if you start at the pavilion. You will make it to the cafe. Half an hour, right? And the Just way that you know how to move from one place to the next is you follow these signs. So you volunteers, your job is to help people move from one location to the next so that we can all experience this whole neighborhood and sort of get the lay of the land before things get started. All right. So we, we have, I, did, we leave, did we leave somebody out? I thought there was an area over there. <laughs> So, we have one more group that we're going to call up, and we have one more, one more cute, one I think more there's song. A song. What's the song? Oh! Oh, it's corny with that Illuminati mess. Paparazzi, catch my fly, my cocky fresh. I'm so. So, if you haven't guessed, our last group is Team Beyonce. Team Beyonce is going to follow this amazing sign, which says Team Beyonce. I'm, should I not tell Team Beyonce where they're going? So Team Beyonce, it's going to be a secret. Um, <laughs> we actually ran out of venues. You should, no, I'm joking. Um, so Team Beyonce, stay put. But you are going to follow Lori and our amazing volunteer with this amazing sign labeled for you. It's going to be great. It's going to be amazing. Just don't move. So these are my people. I'm gonna take my people, and we have exactly the duration of Prince's kiss to get out of here. This whole section, let's cue our song. We're going to the cafe. Let's go. 